Hey there, Canonites. Welcome back. Today, we're going to be doing a live reaction to, well, you know, live in that it's natural, I guess, reaction to uh, the recent Halo Wars 2 news. Uh, if you don't want to see this with my reaction, I've also uploaded a version that has no reaction, so you can just get the raw news. But uh, if you do like this, let me know. Uh, see you at the end of the video. So, turns out the Xbox briefing isn't the only place for exclusive breaking news. Right here on Xbox Daily, we've got a world premiere trailer for the newest chapter. In All the right, Halo here we go, Halo saga. Wars. Here's Halo Wars 2, Halo War 2's new expansion, Awakening. Here the we Nightmare. go. All right, nice. Looks like we're getting some uh, blur cutscenes with this, so that's good. Oh god, you can tell it's a flood already. Oh, this it is! So the Flood are canonically back, okay. I told you not to go inside. Ooh, Atriox is pissed. Oh. Yes, Brute Flood forms! <laughs> No, 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 there's got to be more. Oh, I want more. Right, Halo Wars 2 launched in February, I mean, more visuals. Oh, God, expansion. that looks good. Joining me to tell us more are Brian Gerard, Barry Feather, and Kiki Wolfkill from 343 Industries. Welcome, everybody. Hello. All right, great to see you guys. Always great to see the 343 gang. <laughs> and that sound effect. Now, listen, the trailer we saw from Blur looked amazing. Can you tell us a little bit about Halo Wars 2 uh, for people that don't know about it? Who wants to take that one? Barry? Well, you're in Halo Wars 2. All right, Barry. So, uh, right here. So Halo Wars 2, um, the original, we were UNSC fighting fighting the Banished. Um, in the expansion, we actually flipped that over on its head. We are, fight, are Ooh, fighting against nice. the Banished. Oh, so the Banished uh, campaign is against we, the Flood. Uh, we have uh, uh, an opportunity to to um, to play the bad guy. It's always fun to play the bad guy. Sure. Uh, and I'm guessing so, this will be post... Uh, I think that fans will be really excited. What do you call it? Post... Uh, uh, to play as the brutes to, to have that, that main camp kind of, post main campaign <laughs> i have been playing uh you know the, i've been involved in the halo universe for a long time Not said the flood won't be playable uh, it, it looks like but i saw the flood in there what's that all about <laughs> the flood flood are a great enemy the flood are very terrifying you know we've seen it in, in other halo uh halo games the flood are coming back here the can't wait to see the kind are, of units we uh, get for you know, or that the flood enemy, have you know the nightmare awakened this is this is the whole the whole yeah. point is we have to put them back in their bottle because if they get out, you know, the bad world, things happen. The world ends with with the flood. Now you kind of alluded to it earlier, but for folks that aren't familiar with the Halo, all right. Universe, so we'll be able to establish uh, barriers this time. Why is the flood? Why is it a big deal for Halo fans? Mostly because they can wipe out all sentient life in the. Universe. Wonder if we get access to some of the newer uh, like uh, banished uh, so units, like yeah, maybe some of the Let Go Low stuff. Seen them since uh, Halo Three, and I have to say, because we played uh, in the studio the other day, that that like swarming infestation mechanic. Yeah. Like, you have a really visceral reaction to, right? You have- Get it out, get it out, get it out. <laughs> yeah, right? and, and you don't, <laughs> you definitely don't want to be infected. So um, yeah, so it's kind of cool because it's such a classic element and we get to see them come back and play them in a way that's super different from we've experienced them before. Barry, what else can you tell us about this expansion coming up? So, uh, so again, there is the Banish campaign uh, against the Flood. Um, we have some new Blur cinematics. You saw a little bit of a teaser of of the blur work there. We'll have some more of that. Uh, we have two new leaders, uh, two new brutes Ooh, nice. of Aatrox uh, that will be playable in the, the Banish campaign, but also Very in the nice. player. Um, on, the, on the show four, uh, this <laughs> week we <laughs> have a Terminus Firefight. Which oh is yes, really Flood cool. Firefight. Oh, oh my God. That, uh, is that a Juggernaut? More of a base is that a Flood a Juggernaut? Waves of enemies it's a flood in. fucking juggernaut! We have these new defenses called barricades that do various things, so it's all about how long can you last? Yeah. How many waves can, can you can you play? And you can play as all of the leaders that we've released, both in the original game What's that new the unit they're using? So kind of looks like a mini tactics. phantom. There's different, it'll be 3v3 3 3v3 uh, cooperative, so I'm Jerome and, and I, uh, Aatrox and how they work together. And, you know, all of those interplays will be super awesome. So I want to point out, there's two, there's a lot of components to this, but there's a huge addition for the campaign and multiplayer. So yep. what are some of the bullet points for each one that we can go over? <laughs> I'm not going to speak no. to your game, my friend. <laughs> yeah, sure. I mean, that's what we're talking about. There is a full 
full featured campaign experience yep. from the Banish. Yep. So you play the bad guy, as Barry said, yep. you'll encounter the flood. So there's going to be how will Atriox be able to face this new ancient foe? <laughs> new ancient we'll foe. find out. On the multiplayer side, beyond Terminus Firefight that Barry just mentioned, uh, the team's coming out with two new maps for the classic multiplayer mode that's already in Halo Wars 2. Yeah. But the best part is those are going to be free for everyone. So yeah. if you already own Halo Wars 2, later this fall, you're going to get two more maps that are playable for deathmatch, strongholds, and domination, just to make sure everybody can keep playing together online. Now, Halo fans that have the season pass, what's up with them? Yeah, season pass is still going strong. Yeah. So we have been putting out content every month, uh, new leaders, uh, content updates, new features. Recently, Barry and the team added HDR support for Xbox One S, for example. You have an extra, if you have an Xbox One S and you have an, a 4K uh, TV with HDR, it looks glorious. It's, um, it is amazing. Uh, but we have still have four leaders yet to come with the season pass, two of which are playable here at E3. All right. I think it's, we're going to reveal that right now. We have are we? Commander Jerome. And oh, Arbiter. yes. Booster. Jerome and the Booster. Arbiter. Uh, Ripa, Morami, the Arbiter, yeah. that is. And we still have a few more leaders on tap and a special two-campaign sort of add-on expansion that season pass holders will all be getting in the months to come. Now, th that's great news, but the other part of this is there's, there's tremendous excitement around Halo Wars 2 for in the eSports community. Kiki, tell yeah, us about e -sports. that. Well, um, I don't we've got care. a lot of things going on in July, but we have our big HCS. Uh, both our European and North American finals are happening at DreamHack Atlanta. So that's going to be a huge event. Um, we have a $200,000 prize pool. But what's really cool is, A, that prize pool is partially funded by crowdfunding. And the other thing is, it's the first time we've had our pro league and our open circuit together. So literally anyone <laughs> could win the $200,000. Uh, so that's coming up on July 21st. Where do, where do you know, you, there's a lot of stuff that just happened. Where do people go to check it out online? Uh, so they can go to um, uh, halo.gg. Yep. Uh, it's probably the best place to go, but obviously twitch.tv forward yep. slash Halo and Mixer. Obviously, we're going to be big on Mixer. All right, you guys want to take a qu one question? We only have one time for one question in the community. How's that yeah, sound? Sure, let's do it. All right, from the community, we have Roger1519. Will you ever be able to play as the Flood in a Halo game? Ever Brian. in any Halo game? <laughs> uh, well, in Halo Wars 2, just to play, like, they are bad, but right. you will not play as you the Flood. You will not play as the Flood. You'll play against the Flood. How would you do that? I don't know. They're just, I mean, it's just they're everywhere. Well, you there could be, be a very easy way to do the flood. Ever, ever? I mean, I don't know. Yeah, who knows? Halo Wars 2. Hidden Xperia did a good video on it a while back. Right, so now 343 listens to the community all the time. You guys are unbelievable. So I, I, you know, keep asking. They may do it. All right, now, Kiki, I understand yeah. you brought a little something along special for me. You know that I love giving things away. You do. I know you do. So oh. I will, by proxy, ask you to give some things away. Oh, look at this. We have 15,000 people on the floor. So this is one of my favorite things. It's by AC Worldwide. So it's a Bluetooth speaker. Wait a minute. Signed. That's a speaker? It's yes. A speaker. Not a cat helmet. <laughs> and it lights up. It does. Look at that. It lights up. I have one of these in Pass my this down. I want to take in a look my at. woman cave. You have a, which, uh, oh really? At home. I need to see photos of said woman cave. Yes. That but sounds, also signed check by that a out. bunch of three four. Signed by everybody. Look at this. Wait, now I understand it also. This? It also makes some sounds, right? It did. Let's see. I, I think I may have triggered. Oh, you the, may have triggered uh, it. All right. It's it's yes. it's pretty extraordinary. What else did you bring along? All right. So this. Oh, here we go. Oh Maybe. damn. All right. So this is Triforce made this hand painted life size. Plasma rifle. And these are all signed by 343 Yes, signed by 343ers. This one is the uh, the primary and preferred weapon of the Covenant. Grim signed it. I see. I can look at it right <laughs> here. It's very it special. Yeah. This thing weighs 20. Shout pounds, out to Grim. But life size. Now we're giving these away cool. on the show, right? Is that what? Yes. We're doing? So you get to pick two lucky people. Okay. Did something just break? All right, so, so th choose stay wisely. with us. No pressure. Stay with us. All right, sounds like Halo fans on Xbox and PC. Goddamn Triforce. When Halo Wars 2 Awakening the Nightmare comes out this Oh, it can't come out too soon enough. I hope that doesn't mean we're going to be waiting until November or some shit. Those of you watching at home can join in on the action as well. Tune into Xbox Daily on Wednesday when Brian and Barry are going to join us again to play around of the new game mode. I want to thank everybody here. Thanks for joining us, guys. Thanks, Larry. Thanks. All right. Wednesday's going to be pretty good. I can't wait to see what, you know, look at all that. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, later today, I will uh, have a proper react, or a uh, proper, or if not later today, then tomorrow at the latest, I will have a proper breakdown of everything we learned here today. And uh, until then, I'll, this has been Halo Cannon. 
Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up, subscribing, and sharing it around. You are the reason I get to keep doing this, so thank you, profusely thank you.